Good day, YouTubers. Today we are sad to announce the passing of the legendary Jimmy Buffett. Uh, he was, he's a singer-songwriter who is responsible for such hits as Margaritaville and the, uh, Cheeseburgers in Paradise, among many, many, many other songs. He was sort of a... He didn't really make a lot of videos, uh, but he he had a legion of fans and lived the lifestyle in the warmer parts of like the southern U.S. Gulf Coast. And he he had his fans. I I I I stand myself one of the fans, but I am not what they called a parrot head, which was somebody who was really dedicated to Jimmy and. And went to all his concerts. I'd never been to a Jimmy Buffett concert. And I don't think he ever toured in places where it snowed. Uh, yeah, so the, the lifestyle that, that his songs, his songs are whimsical in a, in a lot of ways. And they basically focus on a lifestyle of hanging out at the beach and living that beach lifestyle. Uh, you see, which you see in the movie After the Sunset with, with Pierce Bronson and uh, Selma Hayek. Uh, he had, I believe he had a bunch of restaurants and, and various other uh, similar uh, bars as well that are themed on the Margaritaville, uh, I guess, legacy. Because Margaritaville, I'm mainly into Margaritaville as a karaoke song. Like I that was my main song I, I, I played in karaoke and I got to the point very, very quickly where I could I didn't even need the karaoke uh display screen to sing the song. Like I could I could close my eyes and just belt that that two note. That's one of the few songs I could actually do that with. But uh yeah Jimmy was loved by his fans and he, he loved touring. He was touring. He was, he was 76 when he died. And as far as I could tell, he was touring rel relatively recently. Uh, he was not big with everybody, but he's, for those of us of my generation, I guess, he was well known for, again, Margaritaville and Cheeseburgers in Paradise. And there, but he did have a, uh, a bit of a, a big following. And it wasn't just old people like myself. It was younger people too. So, DPCN, this, my, my channel, we were paying tribute to Jimmy Buffett. Uh, I did one Jimmy Buffett reaction before, or tribute to before, and I don't think anybody viewed it. <laughs> Which is a shame because Jimmy was a great performer, singer, songwriter. We even saw him in Jurassic Park uh, when all the pterodactyls and stuff were coming into the town, into the uh, tourist town, and and Jimmy was running with his margaritas. <laughs> yeah, he's he's popped up in various movies, in bit parts here and there, but overall, he was a true performer. And his music wasn't just one genre. It was like pop, country, folk. Just covered a lot of, a lot of, uh, a lot of genres. And again, they were very whimsical songs and suited his lifestyle. So today, we're, we are paying tribute to late Jimmy Buffett who passed away yesterday. At the age of seventy-six, because there will be never, there will never be a one, another one like him. He was a very unique fellow, and lived the way he wanted to live. Not caught up in the rat race, but on Margaritaville. Anyway, we're just saying farewell to Jimmy. You guys have a great day. Stay safe. Bye.